With the arrival of the modern TAM light tank EVCTP Infantry Fighting Vehicle Series in 1983, the Argentine Army developed several more notable battlefield vehicles based on the original chassis. The original work was charged to Thyssen Henschel of German, since becoming Rheinmetall Landsystem, and itself was based on the German Army Marder IFV. However, production of the Argentine vehicles was local and handled out of the TAMPS factory in Buenos Aires, Argentina. Beyond the TAM and VCTP headline designs, there emerged the VCA-155 self-propelled gun platform, detailed elsewhere on this site, and the VCLC, Vehiculo de Comate Lanzico Heats equals Rocket Launcher Combat Vehicle, Rocket Projector. Design work on the latter began in 1986, with service entry though to be 1995, along with the VCA-155. The VCLC retains the same hull form and function of the original VCTP IFV, and this includes its German-originated MTU MB 833KA, 500 series six-cylinder diesel of 720 horsepower, and running gear of six double-tired road wheels to a track side. The drive sprocket is at front and the track idler at rear with three track return rollers used. The engine remains at front right of the hull with the driver at front left. The remainder crew consists of the vehicle commander and two specialists. The glassy plate is well sloped for inherent ballistics protection while the sides are only slight sloped in their design. The hull roof is kept flat to a powered mounting platform that fits twin 18x rocket launcher tube batteries. This provides the turret with a full 360-degree traversal for engagement of target areas at all angled. The launcher can further tilt for arced firing at range. The vehicle can carry 36 by 160 mm rockets, or fewer of the larger 350 mm type. Both the rockets and launcher were developed by Israel and can field various warhead types beginning with a standard high-explosive type. The VCLC sports an operational weight of 35 tons, short, with a road range of 320 miles and top road speed of 47 miles per hour, all consistent with the TAM and VCTP vehicle offerings of the modern Argentine Army. The VCLC was produced in limited quantities due to budgetary constraints and may not be higher than 30 vehicles, estimated.